I'm Cindy Yanni. I want to share some of my favorite art sources with you. The first one is Derwent 8B Sketching Pencils. I use this to apply the, the designs to my canvases before I start, and then I use it as a shading tool later in the process. It kind of blends and goes all kind of crazy ways. You can also use them an awfully long time. Here's one that's about an inch and a half long that I'm still using. I also use DeWitt brand ink tints watercolor pencils. They behave the same way. They'll move around in your canvas and they're just great beautiful pigments. My favorite source book in the studio is Loosen Up by Robert Burridge. You have to order it directly from him but it's a great source book. He, he takes lighting principles and design principles and puts them into a one-page explanation with examples. I use this book a lot in the studio. I use Nova Color paints, but I'm going to come back and do a full 60 seconds on nothing but their paints. I also use their gel medium to apply my textures to the canvas. And I use tissue papers, black and white wrapping paper, this is a rag paper that I use a lot. I just peel it off and glue it onto my canvases. And I'm doing that to make my canvas surface more interesting so that it'll grab the paint at different times. I use brushes a lot more than I used to. I use an old sprung sable brush and a nylon brush. And the reason that I'm using these wide sprung brushes is I tend to push down really hard on the surface and I don't want a lot of bristles left. So. These two brushes will take the wear and tear. For white paint, I use Utrecht Gesso. This is actually all the white paint that I use, and I buy it by the gallon directly from Utrecht. To seal my work, I use Minwax brand polyacrylic. And I usually, usually use clear satin as the sheen, but you can use whatever sheen you want. I've been using this about 30 years, um, super product. It only goes on water-based um, uh, material. I also use a big fat brush to apply it, and I, the reason I'm showing you, this is a sprung brush again, so it holds a lot of the polyacrylic and I don't have to constantly redip. My canvases, I usually order them from Jerry's Artorama. And I use the Edge, that's the brand. Um, it's an inch and a half deep uh, gallery wrap. They're a cotton canvas. They're okay, they're not the best in the world, but they're also a really good price, and they're consistently good. So that's my favorite sources. Come back again, and I'll discuss acrylic paint with you.